I am coming at you today with some really exciting new product themes that are available in your Kajabi account. It's been quite a while since Kajabi has added new free themes. Um, and so there are two new ones with some extra features that I'm going to walk you through in this video. And so take a look and see if either of these product themes might be a great fit for your course or membership. So I'm going to head into this dummy product right now. And to get to these new product themes, once you're inside your product, you're going to click customize. And then you're going to choose install template and it's going to bring up all of your options. So the two that um, have been the kind of the backbone most often used product themes in Kajabi are this momentum theme and this premiere theme. Um, and I've done some other videos walking you through these themes before. The creative theme and down here, um, this um, prosper theme are both based off of the premiere theme, just stylized a little bit differently, but they're basically the premiere theme. So really the new themes are the gamify light theme. And you'll see there's actually two of them in here. Um, one of them is based on the look and feel of the premiere theme. And one of them is based on the look and feel of the momentum theme. And then the um, other new theme is called the sunset theme. Um, this one was made by Penny in Your Pocket. And um, the Gamify Light themes were made by Jiffy Courses Online. So let's dive in first to Gamify Light. We're going to look at some of those features. And then we'll come back and look at the sunset theme. So if you want to try any of these themes out in your own Kajabi account, you can click here on the theme if you want to try out Gamify Light and click install template. That will install the template, but it will not replace or override your um, current template that you've got in your product. So no need to worry that it's going to like erase everything that you've already gotten there. It simply adds it here under installed templates and lets you play around with it, but it's not active. If you did want to make that the kind of live active theme, you would click the three dots here and click activate. That would then make it the theme that would be visible to your um, students. So if we go into this Gamify light theme and click customize, you'll see that it very much so looks like the premiere theme, um, except for these badges over here. So this feature is what makes this Gamify light theme so cool. It allows you to gamify and reward your students or members for certain actions that they take. So they can collect different badges and you can grant those badges based on any sort of action that can be done in Kajabi that can trigger an automation. Like a lesson is completed, a quiz or an assessment is passed, if they've purchased an offer, clicked on something in an email, subscribed to like a webinar event or another type of event that you've got going on. So there's tons of options for how you can actually grant these badges to your members. How it works is that the badges are actually created by setting up ghost offers. So I'm going to walk through that um, really quickly next. But a ghost offer just means that you don't have any sort of product associated with it. It's basically just the mechanism for telling Kajabi to grant them the badge over here. So if we look at these badges, you'll see there is a section here underneath sections called Gamify Badges. And if you click into the Gamify Badges section, 
You'll see it gives the um, each badge, it has some information for you to fill in. You're gonna choose that offer, that ghost offer that's going to trigger the badge. And you can hide that badge if you want to when they do not own it yet. Um, you can turn on kind of editor mode so that you can see what it looks like when they actually do own the badge. You can add these labels underneath the badges for certain um, like badge names or telling them how they can earn the badge. Um, so there's some options there. And then you're gonna wanna create your actual badge images. So if they do not own the badge, then you're gonna wanna have kind of a grayed out um, badge or like here they've got the example with a question mark. So you're gonna create that in Canva and just make it a square 400 by 400 pixels are the suggested dimensions. Give it a transparent background and kind of design those badges the way that you want them to look. Um, and then the image here is what it looks like when they actually do earn that badge. So same dimensions as before, you can create those in Canva really easily. So you can create as many of these badges as you want. There's six here in this example, um, <clears throat> but you can create an unlimited number of badges. So the sky's the limit in terms of how many badges that you want to offer to your um, students. So it's very simple to go in and edit those badges there. Um, to actually create, let's go back here, the ghost offer, you're gonna go into sales and then, and then once you're in the sales tab, you're gonna click new offer. You're going to name it the title of your badge. So um, badge name, and you might wanna include your course name as well if you've got kind of multiple courses going on. Um, you don't need to connect it to any sort of products. You leave that blank and then click continue. And then just select free and then save and finish. And you're gonna leave everything else here blank. You don't need to add products, no sort of like emails, anything like that. Um, and then you're gonna click save. Then you're going to go to wherever you want to trigger the badge to get um, awarded to them. So let's say that you want to go back into your product and when they complete a certain lesson, let's say that they complete um, this lesson right here, you can go down to automations at the bottom of the lesson and say, hey, when this lesson is completed, then grant an offer. And you're gonna choose that badge name, um, course name offer that you just set up. You don't need to send them the offer grant email and then click save. So that automation is successfully set up. Now we're gonna go back into the product theme itself. So if we go back into that customize tab, And we go back into the Gamify Light um, template. Then here, if we go into the badge that we want to award, we're gonna select that ghost offer and say that that's going to trigger the badge and click save. And that is how you'll, you'll just follow that same process for every single badge that you want to set up in your account. So for um, both the Gamify Lite, the Premiere version and the Gamify Lite with the sidebar, if we install that template, install, you'll see that this new template, the Gamify Lite with the sidebar, 
it's going to have the same functionality with these badges right here. It's just going to look more like the momentum theme where you've got your categories and your lessons over here on the left-hand side in this sidebar section. Um, but otherwise, the um, Gamify badges right here, that section is going to work the same in terms of setting up the badges to get awarded. Now, if you want to have even more um, options, there is this Gamify Pro version that has um, different styling options, extra gamification features. So definitely check that out. I've got a link to a video tutorial um, that the creator of that theme um, recorded to explain it a little bit more in depth. So check that out if you are looking for some extra gamification features. So that is option one, is this new Gamify Lite theme. And then the um, other new theme is the Sunset theme by Penny in Your Pocket. So if we install that theme and customize it. Let's take a look at some of the features of this theme. Now, this sunset theme is great for um, memberships in particular. So if you have a membership with a lot of content and you want to be able to display that content um, and the premiere theme and the momentum theme aren't really working for you, then check out this sunset theme. This sunset theme, if we preview it here, you can see it's got this really beautiful large dashboard page where you've got full customization options here for text. You've got, you can add videos here, images. You can really customize this main dashboard page um, for any sort of um, information that you want to display on here. So it's got this really large dashboard. And then over here on the left-hand side, you can see the menu is kind of tucked away. But if they click, it will open up this left-hand menu that is similar to the uh, momentum theme, except it has this awesome accordion option where they can actually click to open and close the categories and see the lessons that are underneath. So that is one reason why this is so good for memberships that have a lot more content, because with the regular momentum theme, you're going to overwhelm them by listing, by showing every single lesson down this sidebar. Here, they can kind of pick and choose which ones they want to open and look at first. Um, and then this categories tab right here will take them to a categories page that's going to have all of the categories or modules that you've got set up and then any of your thumbnail images that you've got set up to go with them as well. Um, if we go back here, this will take them back to this main homepage, dashboard page that they can um, grab any sort of information that they need here. And then you've also got the option to add um, links up here in the header. So if you want to add links to, you know, any other resources, pages they might want access to, you can add those up here in the header navigation as well. So this sunset theme, if you um, check it out in your own account, there's also a link here for a walkthrough that Penny, the creator of the theme, has created. So definitely check that out as well. And she'll go even more in depth onto all of the features of this product theme. So very exciting that there are finally some new themes in Kajabi. Um, so definitely check them out. Let me know what you think. And if you end up using any of these for your courses or memberships, don't forget if you are enjoying these video tutorials to subscribe to my channel to get notified when any new videos drop. I typically 
do two new videos a month um, highlighting some of the features in Kajabi. So thanks for watching and I will see you next time.